Hey guys, welcome to another video. Oh my god, it has been a while, hasn't it? When I posted this video, it has been more than a month since I posted the last one and I don't think I ever did such a big break on YouTube which it was kind of nice but also kind of scary um, so thank you so so much if you clicked this video if this is the first one you're seeing from me hi i'm bia i'm an illustrator from portugal um, and if you have been following my journey thank you so so much for still being here and watching my videos and following um, what i show you on my like life as an artist um, yeah i took a little break and yeah, I mean, uh, I'm going to explain a little bit better of what I've been doing, um, what projects I've been doing and all of that. And I talk a little bit more about that by the end of the video. But yeah, I didn't really film an intro for this one. And I wanted to say hi because I really miss chatting with you guys. Um, I never did. Yeah, had such a big, big break, which yeah. Um, it helped me refocus, which was kind of nice, but I'm very, very tired because I've been having some projects, some really excited ones that I can't wait to show you. Um, but yeah, how have you been? What have you been up to in the past month? Um, this is actually some footage since like the beginning of February or something like that. I've been filming here and there um, as I could and as I have been doing some interesting things not only sitting at my desk because i've been having some more illustration projects so not a lot of interesting things well interesting but not to film because it's just me sitting at my desk doing drawing and all of that um so yeah i've been sending some patreon goodies i filmed a little bit of making the pins still for the february box i didn't really film anything making of the march goodies which i'm really really sorry and i wish i had um but yeah it was um i just wanted to send them out as soon as i could um Next week, I'm going to show you the March goodies, which I'm so, so happy with. You can check them on my um, Instagram page. Um, today, the 31st of March is the last day to get them, but I'll soon add them up in the shop. But yeah, as I've been gone, I actually had a bit of a shop update. I added these new pins to the shop, some new clothing. It was actually my worst shop update to date, but let's not talk about that. Um, I just have to assume that I haven't been the best at marketing my shop and talking about my products and all of that. And I just need to get better at that. And it happens, it's fine. Um, it's okay and I just need to improve some things going forward and I really can't wait to create products again. I'm so so excited. I have so many ideas. So yeah, having all of this client work really put to perspective how much I like to create products um, and I in the past few months I actually have been thinking if I still liked it or not, but it was nice to also put that introspective and realize that I still really much love it and packing orders and all of that. I really, really miss it. Uh, so yeah, new collections are coming soon. I also received some new washi tapes, which you saw me doing them in the last studio vlog uh, over a month ago. Um, but yeah, I received them in this vlog, so I can't wait to show you. I uh, really, really like them. I have some thicker ones, which I'm really, really excited about. So yeah, I hope you enjoy them too. Hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry if it's going to be a little bit like some footage here some footage there but i hope you still enjoy keeping me company here in the studio and watching some of the footage of what i've been going on i've been doing for the past weeks so yeah enjoy the vlog and i'll speak with you in a little bit bye
I don't have enough paint bags, so I'm going to try to find some. Not sure if I can find them in local shops, but we'll try. They're not what I was trying to find, but I think they are going to be even better because it's like a big pin. Um, so I think they'll work out, work out better. Um, I was going to add two butterfly clips on the back either way, so I think this will be even better. So let's do it. Pins are done. They turned out so cute. I've been taking some photos like for Instagram and stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm really, really happy with them. So I can finally pack the boxes. I think this option was way better than the two pins because they'll be a lot more fixed. Really happy with them. already goodie boxes in there but new washi tapes just arrived so let's open them okay i thought i was filming but <laughs> apparently i wasn't i still haven't opened them uh, but yeah i'm really really excited about them Okay, I ordered like a simple design like this. It wasn't supposed to be this green, but I'll swatch them with you. What else? Oh, I also ordered some daisy ones. Um, and this used to be a design on the shop, but like a very thin one, but I thought it would be fun to have a bigger size. Then I ordered a restock of the frogs, a restock of the planet ones. Oh, a restock of the berries here and then two new designs, but let me swatch them and we can see them. look great the colors look amazing and sometimes the sticker don't really look how i want them so that's a win so far 
So we have the planet ones, the berries, frog, little daisies, the green flowers and then we have these two new ones these are the first designs that i'm doing with two centimeters and i really wanted to try that out because i feel sometimes that this size is okay but it's a little bit too small for my illustrations and so far i'm loving it so we have the bugs and it looks like this and then we have the fruits and this looks really really nice so let's watch them because i can't wait Okay, color-wise, they look great. I'm really, really happy with that. Um, but I think some of them are like miscuts. Like this frog ones, sometimes they are okay. Otherwise, sometimes they are too close to the edge. So I might have to look into that. And especially for the fruit ones, like the berry got really, really cut. So I'm going to have to see if it was my mistake. But... The bugs one looks so pretty. I'm so happy with that. I want to do um, like one with this pattern on the back, just like a simple pattern. But yeah, overall, I'm really, really happy with them. They look so cute. And with the stickers and all, they all like, like with the perfect colors. Um, that's why it's so important to like change around manufacturers and experiment new ones because I use like three already. And this is the only one that has my colors very, very accurate. Yay! Let me know which one is your favorite. I finally got a new red bar to add here. Let's hope it fits okay. I have to put the big boy on the floor. Please ignore of this floor because I really need to vacuum it. Oh God, it's so heavy. I guess this really shows how much I touch the guillotine. Yeah, need to clean it more. <laughs> so this is how it looks. As you can see, it's really worn out and it was basically already like eating the paper. So I already have this guillotine for like maybe three years, more, four years. Um, and basically what I did is I take this thing out here and then I can switch it over. There's some um, like screws um, on the back of this that you can unscrew um, and then you can switch it over and basically just use all sides until you run out and I basically just use all the sides that I could and now I definitely need to get a new one. First, I take this little thing here. Here you 
go. Do a little try out cut, I guess. <laughs> Don't really have to do as much strength as I had to. <laughs> I was like just pushing the blade down without needing to. Yeah, it's perfect now. That's how it was going sometimes even worse than this but now we have a clean cut yay Hi, it's March 16 right now. Um, I have no idea what I talked about on this vlog. I've been fil filming it since February, I think. I have no idea how people who film like monthly vlogs do it because I can't remember for the life of me what I filmed. It has been quite hard to film and edit YouTube videos. I've been having more client work since the beginning of the year and now that I haven't been more client work, I have this feeling that I don't want to accept it as much as I've been accepted. But, you know, times are hard and scary, so I basically accepted everything that came my way. But now I'm kind of feeling like, basically this is going to be a little catch up with you. Yeah, I've been feeling that I really want to focus on the shop again. I miss creating more products and packing orders and basically having more client work has been making me not being as active on Instagram and YouTube and accepting more client work that was basically the goal that I didn't have to focus so much on like social media and all of that pressure uh, within it but yeah I kind of miss it and I miss posting like regular YouTube videos chatting with you and all of that so yeah I'm basically illustrating a book right now I'm doing I have no idea if I already mentioned this um, I'm doing I'm working with a non-profit organization and I'm going to start doing two books a year with them which is really really exciting so I'm basically on the color phase now I came back from Bologna um, last week and I'm going to do a whole video about it I didn't really film that much in there I wanted to film more so I don't really have a footage for the whole vlog but I'm going to do like a sit down video uh, chatting about my experience what I think I want to do next year what I want to improve going there um, and like how it works I still have no idea how it works but I'm going to try to chat a little bit about it um, and show you yeah all of the kind of things but yeah I miss chatting with you guys I miss creating YouTube videos I miss creating vlogs and sit down videos and tutorials and you know just the community that I built on YouTube I really really miss it and I've been it has been really hard mentally this past couple of months like trying to juggle it all and feeling a bit like a failure because I feel like I'm leaving all this work behind that I worked so much for it um, so yeah it has been hard to find kind of middle ground between it all but yeah I'll keep you posted about that hopefully I will be um, juggling <laughs> a little bit better in the next couple of months also I'm going to have some international markets this year which I'm really excited about so yeah I just want to catch up with you 
let you know what has been going on. Basically, I already illustrated a book in the beginning of the year. But yeah, it has been non-stop and I just feel very overwhelmed. I think I'm going to take a little bit of April off. Thank you so much for being here and still watching my videos. I know how you've been really, really bad at keep keeping up with them. But yeah, it hasn't been easy mentally and keeping up with everything behind the scenes. So I hope you understand and thank you so much for all of your support and yeah hopefully i mean i'm going to start being more irregularly at posting it so yeah i think i'm going to finish this vlog here because i don't want to keep filming not knowing like i filmed so far it, it oh my god my glasses are like doing a lot of reflection so yeah i think i'm going to end it up here i'm going to start a whole new vlog where i'm going to share a bit more about the process of the book um and i think that's going to be interesting i mentioned that in the beginning of the year that was something that i wanted to do when i rented the other studio next door so yeah i think i'm going to grab this opportunity to uh film a little bit more about it and hopefully start my home book in the next couple of months so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'm sorry if it was a mess and all over the place, but yeah, it has been the great in here and time-wise, and I think I'm starting to be severely burned out, so I need to take care of myself. Um, but yeah, I still hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye! Bye!